because there Gujarat has picked up that one point, which means that even if Telugu Yodas win today, they will not be able to eclipse them at the top of the table. But that's for later. It's all about the W. A quick reminder to those who are just tuning in, Rajasthan Warriors' is captain, Mazhar Kalandar Jamadar, as you can see the C next to his name, won the toss and they decided that they're going to defend. Interesting for a side that's only picked up eight defensive points in their three outings so far, but watch out for somebody like Murzabade who will be turning a year older on the 25th, the number 25 for them, you can't miss him. And then Dhananjoy Singh from Manipur, plenty expected from him, the other designated Wazir in this Rajasthan Warriors outfit. They're coming out to defend though. Telugu Yodas on the other side. Pratik Waikar has led them admirably, but certainly plenty of names to watch out for. Let's start with the Vazir Sachin Bhargo and Rokasan Singh, also from uh, Manipur. Those are the two Vazirs. We're underway with match number 12. Six minutes, 54 seconds on the clock. It's the Rajasthan Warriors taking on the Telugu Yodas who are attacking and Rajasthan defending. Three defenders on the mat. They're looking to dismiss one. No, says the umpire. This should be a riveting game with Rajasthan having plenty to prove, Ocean. They're still looking for another one. I mean, look at that. They are trying to go for it, but I guess the referee is ready for it. But the review has been taken so far. Give me umpire. Defender, review. Avoid saying defender out. Defender said not out. Please review. You see that orange, uh, uh, you know, that, uh, what do you call it? What is that? That wristband, yeah, that is up for the captains. And I believe captain can open up the account for this game today. Defender is out. Three points, Cardinal. Review out. But the good news also from Pratik Varkar's point of view, Ocean, is that that wasn't just two points. They opened the account with a three-point skydive. Here comes another skydive. And the, cl and the touch has been claimed as well. A review has been asked for again, but it's not been given. That means Sushant has to Super. go back in the dugout. You cannot do anything. You lost out on one review, and that costs you now more and more points for yourself. Rajasthan Warrior still on zero. It's over three and a half minutes. So he's got the ability, certainly, but this is a tall ask. It was always going to be a huge ask, and Rushi will have to go back, unfortunately. And guess what? All the three touches have come through dives, all of them sky dives, and that has led. Also, watch out for the number 20, Dilrat Singh Singer. He's been the best defender for the Rajasthan Warriors. Has it been a touch? There has been a touch indeed, and three points again. Another skydive attempted and execution to absolute perfection by the Yodas. Spend more than four minutes by Dilrat Singh Singer on the mat. He's adding to that tally. There's an attempt of a skydive. This is an absolutely phenomenal start by the Telugu Yodas. Five defenders dismiss all five through skydive. This is a Herculean effort. And another one. And another batch of three points. That's 18 points. Two batches of defenders dismissed and all through three pointers. This is monumental. We go down with the power play right now. That means we see two receivers on the mat. That means they are two players, two sub players that can move in any direction. You name it. But uh, the other players, they don't have that uh, sort of a thing for themselves. And right now, the chain movement coming up again. You can see those two receivers. It was an interesting strategy. He went for the skydive, but he knew as well that this will only be count as a running touch. Sometimes uh, the attackers tend to pull a bluff on the umpire. What about that dive? That is absolutely phenomenal start from Rokasan Singh. All the way from Manipur, but lighting it up in Pune over here. Went flying in the air from that skydive. Don't miss the replay. Time is the currency for defenders. The more time they spend on the mat, the greater the likelihood of them picking up points. Once again, you cannot change direction if you're not wearing a Wazir color jersey. The man goes for a running touch. He went, he attempted the skydive, gets only a running touch, and the heart goes out to Sushant Kaldone, who survived 2 minutes 17 seconds along with his partners Akshay and Suresh, but couldn't quite get that dream run. We'll definitely have a look as, uh, you know, what happened in a few previous minutes. But uh, talk about these few outs, you know, the way they were given. This this, this skydive was pretty, pretty good as the goal was given up, moving around the pool. And then this attempt, this was a phenomenal one, I believe. And that's how the adrenaline was up in the players and in the audience as well. Look at that jump. Give it up a good call. The change of direction definitely happening up. But now if you talk about SK, the SK Murtaja, Ali Dhananjay Singh and Mohamed Asi, they are out here. But it looks like a full dive was supposed to happen. But oh, this was a good touch. How good has Arun Gumki been in this uh, ultimate Coco League so far? We talk about Mazhar Kalandar, but Arun Gumki is right alongside him and amongst the best attackers. 
But also we got a good glimpse of what a Bazir can do when Rokasan Singh was after Murtaja Ali not too long ago, changing directions and at the same time Murtaja was dodging and diving away. Here goes uh, another attack. Wycott is claiming a touch. But a review has been asked for. A three-point skydive has been given though. Three-point skydive. means a full on chase has oh, been no, no, no. and that is definitely going to be looking really good oh, no, no, no. on to the report card of Telugu Yotas they get three pointer to end this up for themselves and I believe Telugu Yotas with 36 and 0 are going to be looking really really good now Rajasthan Warriors they have a headache on for themselves as they anticipated nothing happened all the three defenders still on the mat as of now moving around the pool but I believe it's a touch oh, it's it. Can survive for another 20. 
that means this could be a four point dream run if he can survive five seconds it's less than three now for Arun Gunki he keeps going and he will pick up a four point dream run what a spectacular and stellar effort this has been from Arun Gunki coming up sensational right now to add that one extra S in the Super Sunday if you talk about it and now it might just look like a bad thing for him as that was a dive and it looks like this time the sky dive three pointer coming up they were close but then the timer I mean four seconds on the clock what's gonna happen but I believe that dream run definitely helped up Telugu Yodas a lot in this one look at this he played by his wits he played by the poles he played in between the attackers he played by the mind to get those two plus two for himself but never say never Warriors 20 points behind at the moment and it starts right now one sentence they finish up one of the turns for themselves 24 and 44 i mean that's a 20 point deficit coming up for rajasthan warriors they'll have to do something i'm telling you they'll have to do something innings number one attacking points for rajasthan 24 defending six for you telugu yodas but it's 44 24 the score line that matters I'm going to show you this is not the best batch of defenders for Rajasthan Warriors whose uh, defense has anyway been conspicuous by its absence. They've only picked up eight defensive points in their three games before this. Here's a skydive attempt. He's claiming it is Rohan. The umpire on the far side, Mr. Dinesh Adhikari from Odisha has agreed to his demand as well. And the number six, SK Murtajali, will have to depart. Dhananjay and Mohamed Tassin. Another jump coming up. Another dive attempt was out there. And that has been given. Another three-pointer coming up. Telugu Yotas. They are looking pretty brilliant with a half-century completion for themselves. And we have five minutes and 45 seconds on the clock with a turn three. Still out there, Mohamed Tassin. Can he survive? That's a big question. The answer might just come up as no as it's another skydive coming up. And that's 53 for Telugu Yotas.